Welcome back. So, curiosity got the better of me of how much one of these MP5196 A's actually take. At the moment, I've got all four of them connected up still. I've got it connected in series um, on one of the inputs there. Um, to my multimeter here, that can do uh, milliamps. I've got it set onto the milliamp range. Um, and as you can see, with all four of them going together, it's about 135 uh, milliamps altogether there. Um, and that's for all four of them. So divide that by four, that's around 30, uh, 34 milliamps, something like that. So 34 milliamps per meter here. So I thought it was just an interesting little experiment. Um, just something that uh, out of interest really. Um, so now you know how much one of these meters take. It's around 36 milliamps. Thanks for watching. And just to prove that concept to you, um, I've disconnected all four of the other meters. This one's not connected to anything at the moment. We're still on the milliamp range. And here we have it. It's 33.5 milliamps on the meter here. So there you have it, that's how much <clears throat> one of these single phase MP5196As take. Thanks for watching.